One of my favorite quotes is, you might see one, but we stand at 10,000. I remember growing up, I had a poster of Mae Jameson, who is the first African-American woman to go into space. That made me feel like I should be in aerospace as well. I also had an uncle, which um, I used to call him fondly Uncle Mathematics because he would always test uh, my math skills. So he would immediately ask me, what's 12 times 12? And I had to immediately say 144. First, I'm first generation as being a college graduate. In addition, I'm first generation as a Haitian American to the United States as well. Uh, being a representative of those two different um, demographics means to me that I have to set an example. Being an example means that I have to create a pipeline for future female engineers within my field in aerospace engineering. One assumption that I would like to change about women in the workplace is that women don't like the tough jobs or the dirty jobs. For my role as a CAM here at MFC, I'm responsible for the sustainment contract of repairs. Whenever the repairs come back from the field, I actually go to the depot. I wanna see what's being repaired before it's going out to the field. I wanna make sure that we are meeting the expectations of our customers. I'm not afraid of the dirty work and I know my female engineers aren't as well. absolutely go for it. Within STEM, there are very few women in the field. I believe we're 9%, but one of my favorite quotes is, you might see one, but we stand at 10,000.